はいそれでは御起立の上拍手で Ladies and gentlemen, we ask you to rise and welcome Dr. Mahathir.ありがとうございました。
leaders of Japan's uh, business community. Uh, we, Malaysia and uh, Japan, has always had very good relations, and we know that Japan has contributed much towards the growth of Malaysia, not least by your foreign investments, but also by accepting our people to study in, in Japan and also in, in certain cases to learn uh, the work ethics of the Japanese. Uh, we believe that uh, your success is due to your culture. So we want not only to, uh, to trade or to get investment from Japan, but also to learn about the culture that has enabled Japan to do so well. Uh, we hope that uh, if we can adopt some of these uh, cultural values, uh, we will also be able to grow as Japan has grown. But uh, I have always found Japan very hospitable, whether I am prime minister or I am a retired prime minister, uh, Japan has always been very kind whenever I, I come to Japan and I find it extremely comfortable to be in Japan. I hope that uh, this translates into greater cooperation between our, our two countries. Uh, the new government of Malaysia is going to be business friendly. We are going to welcome foreign direct investment uh, and we are not going to have too many bureaucratic uh, hindrances or procedures which would deter uh, foreign investors. For this, we need your cooperation. You must tell us what is it that uh, gets in the way of your investments in Malaysia, and the Malaysian government will give due consideration to your uh, problems and try to resolve them. That is going to be our attitude. We are going to, still going to be a very open economy, but uh, uh, apart from uh, foreign direct investment, we expect to learn how to produce things by ourselves. And for that, of course, uh, we need uh, Japanese technology, which is very advanced. And we think that coupled with uh, Japanese way of working or work ethics and Japanese technology, uh, we would be able to develop our country uh, much faster. We had a great ambition to become a fully developed country by the year 2020. But unfortunately, changes made in the policies of the government over the past uh, uh, 15 years has made the objective uh, far from uh, accessible to the Malaysia, Malaysian people. But we hope to, uh, to do things uh, with the right, the right kind of policy so as to achieve the objective of becoming a developed country. Maybe not in 2020, maybe a little bit later. For this, of course, we want to learn again, learn from Japan. Uh, and we are very grateful that Japanese uh, business people have been very positive about Malaysia. <coughs> Among the first companies, uh, manufacturing companies uh, set up by foreigners in Malaysia were the Japanese company, I think Panasonic, or at that time it was called National, uh, was among the first uh, factory that was set up in Malaysia. But today, as you say, we have 1,400 Japanese in, uh, plants in Malaysia, and of course we hope to have more than that, because each plant that you put up means good jobs for our people. One of the present problems we have is unemployment, and for this, we need to have new investments uh, from abroad as well as domestically so as to create jobs for our people. So I am here because, of course, because I 
oh, every year I come for the Nikkei uh, conference, but uh, this time I would like also to speak up for Malaysia and invite Japan to partner Malaysia in the development of a country which is really uh, potentially capable of becoming developed within a short period of time. I thank you. Thank you very much, uh, Dr. Mahatil. So I would like to ask the press people uh, to leave the room at this moment. So um, I would like to call upon the, some representatives from the Japanese side to make a brief speech. Uh, there will be three people who will be speaking, and after that, we would like to have the uh, comments from Dr. Mahatil. So first of all, uh, Chairman of Japan Foreign Trade Council, Mr. Nakamura. Good morning. I'm the Chairman of Japan Foreign Trade Council uh, from Sumitomo Corporation. My name is Nakamura. Your Excellency, to Dr. Mahatil, I cordially welcome you to Japan and feel very honored to have this opportunity to meet you. Japan Foreign Trade Council, at which I serve as chairman, is an industrial organization composed by trading companies. General trading co corporations, which are the central constituents of the Council, are engaged in a wide range of businesses on a global scale, with trading as a core and including the establishment of value chains and investments in businesses inside and outside Japan. We at Sumitomo Corporation have diversified business relationships with Malaysia. Sumitomo Corporation opened its office in Malaysia in 1960 and has been engaged in trade of tubular products and chemical products, among others, businesses such as steel processing and fertilizer manufacturing, and investments in power generation, railroad, and other infrastructure projects. <laughs> 